Hi guys, I'm Josh Wolf, and we are here in the B-Matrix factory in Atlanta to look at our Exhibitor Live 2020 booth. You'll see behind me, it's kind of playing off a factory theme, so it's fitting we're here in our production facility. And integrated throughout the booth are quite a few new innovations for this year. So in the next few minutes, we're gonna take some time, we're gonna walk through the booth and show you a close-up look at all these new exciting products. Come on, let's go take a look. Now we're going to take a look at the new B truss. Now this is an exciting new development. It's a structural product intended to allow you to span larger and build bigger with your B matrix inventory. Now, unlike a traditional box truss or stage truss, this product can be covered just like your traditional B matrix frame inventory. You could put a hard panel in the frame with Velcro or use the integrated FEG slot to put a fabric graphic on it. Now, again, this is a structural product, so it can be used horizontally be used vertically uh, to make very, very large elements in your exhibit. You'll notice here behind me, we have a large sign structure. Uh, the verticals and the horizontals are all B-truss covered with a hard panel. And we have integrated the LED skin because it adapts directly to the B-truss. So it's a really exciting new product that expands your capabilities and being able to build much larger structures out of your standard inventory. So here on the interior of the booth, you can get a better look at B-truss in use. We have the 310 box truss here running horizontally and vertically. And a little bit closer to you, we have the 310 ladder truss used uh, to spread and provide a little bit more structure to this assembly. You'll notice in this case, we have used our new track lighting mounted directly to the bottom of the truss. I'm gonna take a little closer look at the coverings of the B truss. You'll see here, it looks like a traditional column, but actually we have a fabric and a hard panel both on the same column. So let's peel back the infill. You'll see here the hard panel is attached with the perfect cover and the fabric itself is utilizing the track inside the truss. Uh, so the two of these items allow you to really cover it up and the truss disappears. From this angle, you can see yet another one of the integratable features into the B truss. Uh, this is our light box. Uh, it's quite a large elevation. It looks much like a billboard. Uh, it's wrapped left and right with fabric, uh, top and bottom. There are some hard panels. Uh, it's a really nice look on a flush mounted light box. Here's a nice look at the truss from above. Uh, you can see several different elements here. One is that this LED skin assembly is hanging from the truss itself. And again, it's boxed by the columns left and right. And then below, there is another level, about the 10 foot level, that is supporting the lighting for the first floor below. One of our most exciting innovations of the year 2020 is our new double deck system. You'll notice behind me, or maybe you won't notice, uh, the deck structure is covered almost entirely. You have the primary boom overhead that's covered with a hard panel infill, and that connects into a vertical post and then here, closed in with a standard B62 frame, uh, once again covered with a hard panel. Of course, moving right on to the door and even the video skin, LED skin, you'll see above me used as a railing. Uh, just another way that you can integrate your standard B-Matrix inventory into a new, larger element, the double deck. So now we're underneath the deck, and here we're going to look at how you can build a ceiling and how that integrates with the floor. So here we actually have the secondary beam, and this is what supports your floor overhead. And then you'll have a frame that connects right to the beam to make a flush finish. So if you'll see over my head, you have here the standard frame attached to the bottom of the beam, 
and it makes a very nice flush ceiling uh, and leaves none of the decking framing exposed. Well, we've left the infills off here so you can see the sway bracing. This is actually installed into a standard B62 frame and this prevents any lateral movement. Uh, you'll see how this fits nicely in between the vertical beam and standard framing and of course this can be covered once you're finished to completely hide the bracing. So the stairs of our double deck product are fairly unique. There is a custom angled frame, but it does come with the kit, so that's not something you have to worry about sourcing. Uh, as with the upper level, there are some steel supports inside the railing. Uh, you also have the ability to cover the stringer here, or the riser. Uh, there are some Velcro panels here. It'll give you another branding opportunity, as well as another opportunity to integrate the look of your deck into the graphic scheme of your booth. The railing consists of a tube mounted on top of a standard B62 frame. Uh, you'll notice there is a rounded cover here. That's to prevent people from sitting anything on the railing that might fall off. And we've also added some steel supports inside the frame to give you that strong structural capability. And then as with a traditional B62 frame, it can be covered with a hard panel. So we'll put this infill in here. And also you'll notice the post is still exposed. Uh, but we have made it to where you can put an infill over the post and thus is the unique value of the B-Matrix deck and being able to integrate the structure with your existing B62 inventory. So one of the nice features about the double deck is the railing can be mounted externally or internally. So in this instance, you have your standard uh, external mounted railing. But on this side, say you want to put a video wall or a light box in this instance, you can move the railing in and still have the ability to mount both products to the pole of the deck. It's a really nice feature. This year we've made some small changes to the LED skin curved and corner tiles. Whereas from the outside, it still looks like your same 90 degree tile that we've had before. Uh, same with the curve, it's a nice two foot radius. So really nothing different from the outside, uh, but we're gonna go underneath and we'll show you where the changes actually occurred. So now we're behind the scenes with the LED skin product. Uh, you'll notice in the version 2.0, it is now a molded frame instead of a milled frame that's put together with multiple pieces. And this holds true with both the 90 degree tile and the curved tile. Uh, what this means to you is easier installation. There's no adjustment required. You simply turn the latches that are included in the standard straight frames and it all fits together nice and easy, no adjustment required. So one of my more favorite innovations this year is the new sliding door. See, it's much like a barn door, it just slides nicely, slides open. And the point here is to be able to have a nice low profile installation that doesn't take up space, uh, let's say on the inside of your closet or a conference room. It's a really space saving option and it's a nice smooth operation. And as with the rest of the framing system, you can put a hard panel or a fabric infill onto the frame. So here you can see the new barn door from the inside. It has a nice integrated track that attaches to your standard B62 frame. And again, it's a nice low profile installation, so it slides in line. Uh, space saving option for small spaces like a closet or a small conference room. Really nice new product here. This is a new profile we've created to give you the ability to add track lighting. Uh, we'll point out it is just a profile. Uh, you will have to provide the electronics that go inside. That's made by a company called U-Track, and you can get that specific to your market or the type of lighting that you're using. So here overhead, we have it used in between multiple frames. It's a nice slim uh, installation. And then overhead in this direction, we've actually mounted it to a piece of our B310 ladder truss. It gives you a really nice option to hang more of your traditional track lighting onto your standard B matrix product. I'd like to point out some of the infills that we've used this year. And while this does look very custom, the reality is all the structure underneath is actually standard. Uh, so here we've put a faux brick finish around a 2R radius frame, along with a straight frame. And then we have stacked LED skin on top of that with the new 
LED skin 2.0 curve and the standard straight frame and then continuing again above with more of the faux brick. I think it, it works really well in giving us that industrial feeling that we were going for in the frame factory. So that concludes the tour of our booth today. Thank you for joining us and taking a few minutes to look at these new innovations. Uh, we hope you're as excited as we are about these truss products and the, and the double deck. Uh, really allow you to build larger, more impressive exhibits out of your standard off-the-shelf inventory. If you do have any questions about these items, please feel free to reach out to your assigned B-Matrix rep or just send an email to info at bmatrix.us and we'll be glad to have a conversation with you.